It's the sound of the basketball. It's the sound of the swish. Basketball is more than just a sport. It's addicting. I was born with a broken femur, and uh, they have a fancy name for it, um, but that's what it was. My parents had a terribly hard decision. They had to either lengthen my femur bone and not allow me to run my entire life, because that's just a consequence of lengthening a bone, or they could amputate my right foot and give me a prosthetic leg to make up the height difference. Uh, it took about three years. Lots of physicians uh, gave their input. The prosthetic department at Shriners uh, was very impactful. We talked to families uh, that were both lengthened and also that were amputees. And what I think made our final decision was we met a little girl who was an amputee and she just rocked our world and we thought, you know what, it's all going to be fine. They made the right decision. I mean, I've lived 100% of full life. In the, in the game, you don't feel much. You don't see anything past the lines. You don't, you don't see the crowd, you don't see the fans, you don't see, the, see anything except what's right in front of you, your teammates and the opponents. When he signed up to play Mizzou wheelchair basketball, he had his sights set on going as far as the sport could take him. Um, and he is driven beyond any other athlete I, I've come across. You know, having an injury like a torn pec this first run at Team USA is really frustrating. It happened in this most, you know, the dumbest way possible. I was on a bench press. The trainer, unfortunately, put on 150 kilos and not 150 pounds. And so I was sitting there with over 300 pounds on my chest and I couldn't get it up. And I just immediately felt it hurt and I immediately felt it just, it was like a burning hurt too. It was like a weird hurt. The next morning I woke up and I, I had a breast, I had, it was out to here, and like, I freaked out because am I turning into a woman? <laughs> Everything happens for a reason, this is something that he was meant to deal with, and um, it may have been a blessing in disi disguise because it showed his character. It's a place where so many things have happened in my life, so many memories, so many, you know, moments that just include competition and victory and defeat and uh, the sounds that come along with it are just, they make it what it is. Here, basketball player, college basketball in a wheelchair, he was totally learning. Second year he was breaking records, third year he broke all the records. You step in gym, gear up, put on your USA jersey, then to see these other guys doing the same thing. It's a, it's a, these are men. But at the end of the day, I, I know I left it all on the court. <laughs>